The story of Timon of Athens. Well, Lady Timon, in our version, is a celebrated, generous, famous philanthropist in the city and hosts many dinners and gives to many good causes. But there's a problem. She has been suffering from mounting debts and there's a crisis when the money runs out and she's forced to confront her situation. She has nothing. She uh, copes with this with resilience by um, deciding that it's all going to be fine. She's going to go to all the friends that she's helped in the past and they're going to help her in return. What happens is they decide not to help her. They don't have the money in quotation marks. They find reasons to resist rescuing her. She becomes increasingly traumatised, disappointed and despairing at the action of her so-called friends and decides to leave the city and become a, a hermit. She suffers a breakdown and becomes increasingly furious and despairing at the state of events. Meanwhile, her, one of her more loyal friends decides to mount a campaign for Timon to be reinstated in the city and in doing so becomes in a violent confrontation with the authorities of Athens. As they, these two sides are reaching a climactic encounter, news arrives that Timon has died. And it's the death of Timon that causes both of these parties to pause and reflect on what really does matter and what potential there is for a new alliance, a new truce between politics and power. So Timon dies howling at the injustice of the world, yet her death allows a new justice to potentially come forth.